Well, the final day of development camp, it finished this afternoon here at the Ice House. And I'll tell you what a competition it was. There were scrimmages. They had two-on-two, four-on-four, three-on-three. They had relay races. They had some breakaway drills. But Team White walked away victorious, led by Ryan Johansson, outstanding in the shootout against Cam Atkinson and the blue team. The place was full, 105 degrees outside. Inside, yes, a full house. They were hot on the ice. And we had a chance to talk with some of the players and coaches at the conclusion of today's events. Yeah, it was fun out there. I mean, uh, you know, it's a, lot, it's a lot better when you're playing games like that and you're competing against each other. I mean, it's a lot better than just going out and doing drills or just, you know, running a mile and a half or something. It's a lot more fun. It's tiring, but uh, I think it was a really good day. I feel like I've uh, kind of gotten no, uh, you know, gotten back on the kind of North American ice again, and uh, also you know this pace, uh, you know, some of these guys, uh, you know, they're already pros, so um, uh, you know that's where I want to be someday. You know, it's hard to single out guys. I mean, you know, you look at a guy like uh, uh, Dalton Smith, who, who's from the first time I saw him to where he's now. I mean, his skating ability, I think, is a lot better. He's improved. I mean. Um, even guys like Cam, we, we had half a year last year. I mean, he's just a, he's a smooth, skilled kid, and he's only going to get better with time. Um, you could probably go through everybody and, and do something like that, but uh, these guys are working hard, and everybody's trying to get better, you know, and it's, it's good to see that, uh, that these guys are putting in the time. This concludes development camp here in Columbus. The players now, they'll make their way back to their respective countries as well as universities, junior teams. Throughout the course of the summer, evaluations will be made. They'll get ready then again for their training camps. And I think one thing that you're going to find, you're going to find a lot of hardworking players to be able to do the job. For Jackets TV, presented by Ohio Health, I'm Bill Davidge.